What's going on my dudes, One Step here with the ultimate guide to Frost as a cameo in Mortal Kombat 1. Giving you some tips, tricks, and strategies, and of course some best character recommendations to pair her up with. Frost. Take it one step at a time. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and let's go ahead and jump right into it. Start off with the tips and tricks on her move sets. Go over her standard cameo move is Ice Crash. A great way to end combos if needed. And if you hold the cameo button, you get a different property. Your character is locked in animation, so you can't really do anything during that. But again, another great way to end a combo. Holding it does do more damage and doesn't cost any more meter as well. So if you get the chance, I recommend just holding it to get the extra property. Keep in mind, your standard cameo move is a great wake up attack because you gain armor on it. Here's how that might look. Her back cameo is snowflakes and it kind of sends out this ice ball. That of course, if hit freezes your opponent, allowing you to combo off of that, it's really good for pressure. It makes your opponent not want to approach you. So you can decide, okay, what are we gonna do here? You can cancel it by pressing down, down during it. Just in case you read your opponent reading you and you want to say, oh, no, never mind, I'm good. Because it is 68 frames on startup, meaning it's quite slow and your opponent will probably react to it if they read it fast enough. You might think that Ice Ball move for her back cameo is not that great because it's so slow and you don't care for the pressure, but there are characters like Sindel that have a great move with her back three that put her opponent on the other side of her from where she started. But that kind of thing is so good with Frost's back cameo, the Ice Ball, because you can just put your opponent into the Ice Ball and then get a combo off. And without his axe, even I know Xiao has one of those moves. Characters like this that have a move that put your opponent on the other side of you can really benefit off of Frost's Ice Ball. And then Frost's forward cameo move is a low hitting freeze attack that's full screen and really can catch your opponent off guard. Not only is this a great move for combo extension, but it's also a great move to pair with characters that don't have a low move or don't have any kind of low hitting setup. Frost can replace that and be so good for it. But even if you got a low setup, it's still great to use. Some strategies that I like to use with Frost are of course the Ice Ball and just have that pressure on the field. No matter who you play, that can be awesome pressure and really make your opponent not want to approach you and make them second guess how they're gonna do it. I love ending combos with their held down cameo move. I believe that Frost is actually one of those cameos that's a great choice for almost any character on the Mortal Kombat roster. The low freeze allows for awesome combo extension, but other characters might benefit a bit more off of that freeze. Characters like Lee Mei that want to do a lantern setup, Ashra who wants to go from dark to light and needs that time, characters like Rain and Katana who want to set up a trap while they're frozen, or characters like Sindel and General Shao that have that move that puts your opponent on the other side of you. But again, I think there's so many characters that benefit from Frost's moveset. It's up to you to decide how you want to use User. These are just my recommendations guys. Let me know down below What do you think of Frost in Mortal Kombat 1 as a cameo? Do you like her? Do you hate her? And who do you pair her up with? Let me know down below. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and take it one step at a time.